Well, we'll start off today's video with this is the dust deputy. This is the sanding dust that it's uh, capturing instead of it going into the shop back and through a filter and having to be dumped out from a bag. We can just dump that. We've been working on the uh, starboard side repair for 1965 Alcourt Sunfish Wave. And what we did today was we uh, flipped the boat and we sanded off the excess epoxy from where we grafted in the uh, this uh, chunk of the side here. Got it all smooth and now we've come back. There were some uh, little voids in the uh, bottom part of the repair. It's all sealed up internally with the backer plate, but we wanted to fill the little voids with actual thick so thickened adhesive to give it a little bit of a structural, continue that structural bond here. So that's what the brown goop is down the seam. So we pushed it in using a high thrust caulk gun through the mixing tip. We came back, laid a little bead over the top of it so that when we go to sand that smooth again, uh, hopefully we won't have any little pits or any little pinholes. Then we hit a few areas with the uh, Total boats, total fare, fairing compound, that's what the green stuff is. We had a few holes that were sealed up from the inside. We had put in screws through to hold plates to sandwich this hole repaired together. Removed those, sealed up the holes, and now we're fairing over the holes. Here's the, the uh, side seam. Give it another coat of fairing. Once this uh, thick so, in the seam is dry, we'll sand it smooth, then we'll come back with the coat of uh, fairing compound over the top of it. So well, I had the fairing compound, compound out, hit a few more little holes, nooks, uh, nicks, nicks and crannies. Had a little repair on the deck flange we did, so we're gonna get that all sanded fair. And put just a little bit bit more now the boat's upside down we can see on the bottom side of the the bow flange here a few more things but um, we are ecstatic when we look at the curve the line of the boat that comes in just super nice all the way back and the two pieces on the bottom were mostly flush in most places you can see where I've had to uh, flatten that a little bit on some parts of the deck to get everything nice and flush. And once we get that sanded and fared, primed and painted, I'm uh, gonna challenge folks to even find out where that was because it's come out real nice. So we're pretty happy with that. We hope y'all are having great holidays and looking forward to the new year.